Welcome back to Quantum Break. We really have hustled on quite quickly through this game. I'm quite impressed with the progress. We're now at five, part three, so that we must be on the final stages now, because if we've just got back to uh, the swimming center, the swimming pool, where the, the second time machine is, hopefully trying to get back to the future. Who knows what's gonna happen there? We might meet the, uh, the bad guy there. Can't remember his name. Um, James is the main guy. Anyway, if you've enjoyed this series of videos, then consider subscribing to the channel for more content like this. Wanna get on with this one? Let's see if it gets to the end. Wait a second. the machine here. You really never used it yourself? No, I didn't dare. Not after the men came out. It was Paul. He tried to kill me. Clearly he wants to go this way then. Rusted shut. Jack, a hand? Oh. One more time. Did it. When Monarch came for the time machine at the university, Paul was trapped in it. He escaped into the future. Whatever happened to him there changed him. Somehow he found my machine there, and used it to come back to 1999. And found in Monarch. He escaped from Monarch, and became what he escaped from. Insanity. I never should have built the machine. I should have left well enough alone. It's back here. Right then. Just the way I left it. Hope it still works. Yeah. All right, we'll go to the future. A little after your time of departure, before the fracture has stopped time permanently. I don't know, I'm a, I'm a little concerned about this. It'll be dangerous. Of course it'll be dangerous. At this point, what isn't? But I have been curious to try this. Jack, when we exit, it'll be a little past the point you were at when you left to save me. That's our window, when we know it can work, but before time actually ends for good. It may not be much of a window. Monarch was sure it was imminent. Huh. Like they're experts. They kind of are. All they know they stole from me. You worry about your end, I'll worry about mine. All right, Will. That works. This is amazing. All those years, I never knew. Crap. Hang on, Will. Damn it. What the hell? No, 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 no. Down. Time to move. 
Yeah, get out on all the yell. Will. I need to get him moving. We don't have time for this. <gasps> we ain't got time for that. Forget Will, Jack! Oh no. However he came to be here, he's done. It's over. What's going on, Paul? You look fucked up. Even by your fucked up stands. <sighs> you took the CFR, Jack. I took it back. I don't care how messed up you are, Paul. You're not taking it from me. I don't want it! I just want it gone. Forever. Gone? What about your survival plan? Fuck the lifeboat, Jack! We're just gonna let the clock run out on this and be done with it. Oh dear, find a boss fight then, is it? Get chinned, mate.
Never mind. Tell me later. We got work to do. Okay. I'll have to hook up the countermeasure to the core. It's designed to hypersaturate the Maya Joyce field with chronon particles. The time machine's like an amplifier. That'll cause a chain reaction and rejuvenate the field. It'll be a universal. What do you need? The countermeasure's charge is low. We'll need a jolt of chronon particles. A jump start. That's you. It stitched time back together everywhere. <coughs> the destruction couldn't be undone. The lies we lost were real. But we fixed it. Jack. <sighs> Will. Clocks kept on ticking. Come on. Come on. I think we just saved the universe. Yeah. Where's Paul? He's dead. He's gone. I don't know. It doesn't matter. Will, he was wrong about everything. Was he? Will. The countermeasure worked. Whoa. The countermeasure burned out. Should be stable now. Of course, I'll have to run a few tests to confirm. But this. Well, there's no reason to believe that the fracture isn't over. One more question. Paul Serene's entire philosophy was that time is a set path and nothing can be changed. At the time, you obviously disagreed. But after everything you've seen and done, we need to know. What do you believe now? Was he right? Or is it possible to change things? I'll come back for you. You've been very patient with us and very helpful. Thank you. Yeah, well, that patience is starting to wear pretty thin. Of course. Right outside. Mr. Joyce. Finally. Thought you wanted to talk, not get my life story. Well, you were at the heart of all of this. And you can understand our need to find out exactly what happened. I heard it's all being pinned on Paul. It's quite the feat. Paul Serene always danced to his own tune, you know that. He and his delusions did tremendous damage to Monarch. But we can still salvage this company. We could use a man like you. It's not the same monarch you know, Mr. Joyce. Your exceptional qualities are obvious. And we both know you have certain needs our expertise could help with. We can help each other. Be 
you're right, I will not have it playing. So if I'm not getting another copy stroke strike. Anyway, well that was Quantum Break. That was quite a an intense end battle, needless to say. A little bit more on the classic side of uh sort of on the old sort of style type game sort of ending there where it's all going on and whatnot. And that was a very good cutscene at the end and that bit when he says to Beth he's coming back he gave me goosebumps. Not gonna lie, big goosebumps. And I really enjoyed and had so much fun playing this game. So if you guys are enjoying my content, please consider subscribing to the channel and definitely please like this video. I'm not sure what the next video is gonna list series is gonna be, but we're all in for the long haul. So I'll see you guys on the next video.